The past few days have been among the most difficult in my life. The hearts of every single New Yorker are literally broken in two, especially Buffalonians. One half grieving for these families that are still bewildered. The mainstreaming of hate speech, of racism, nationalism, white supremacy, and the easy access to military-style weapons and magazines. We can no longer look away, and we're not just going to call it out. We need to directly address the deadly threat that it is. Today, I'll be signing an executive order requiring the state police to file an extreme risk order of protection under New York's red flag law when they believe that an individual is a threat to himself, herself, or others. Previously, current law, it's an option to do so. And now it'll be a requirement. You may have known this, we had actually planned this press conference prior to the Buffalo massacre because we knew that there are areas where our laws need to be bolstered. We're proud of having tough gun laws, no doubt about it. But as time goes on, you start to see the loopholes because the criminals are very, very clever. So we had to ban ghost guns. Who would have thought there could be such a thing as a ghost gun that you could order the parts online and manufacture a lethal weapon in your home? Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.